I love hats. Yeah. I'm a hat guy. <laughs> morning is the first day in so long that we woke up and it's warm. We're wearing shorts. So we're gonna just hang out and enjoy this morning. Enjoy our decaf coffee and soak in this weather. It's hot as hell. It's only hot because my AC is broken. AC still broken. <sighs> well, that's cold air. Oh man, it feels so uh, good. We got, I was just so lucky. I was so lucky. Terminal to the AC compressor unpinned from the socket. Oh. So he went ahead and pinned it back and <gasps> recharged the AC. Oh, perfect. Oh. So is it working? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Oh my goodness. I had a feeling it was something really like weird or minor because <laughs> it was just so sudden. I knew it was going to be something minor and I knew it was like an electrical issue or, and it wasn't any leaks or anything. And sure enough, a wire had popped out of place and they just popped it back into place. And the guy helping us out was really, really nice. They were, he was. they were very, very helpful because they were closing in like an hour and a half and we just walked in. <laughs> and we were five minutes away from the dealership when my check engine oil light popped on. So we also got that taken care of. It was super lucky. Imagine if it popped on five minutes after we left. Yeah, I know. Overall, everything is fixed. We are good to go. And, and it is just off our shoulders for now. Mm-hmm. And now we're at Alberton's. We're gonna get some groceries and head on. Head on. Well, we are currently sitting in Joshua Tree National Park. We're about to hike the Mastodon Peak Trail Loop, which I believe is only about two and a half miles. We're here at like prime time hot day. So I don't know if this is gonna be a mistake or not, but it said it was easy. First thing I notice as soon as I step on this trail is it's like walking through sand, which we haven't really done. It's usually like a gravel worn down trail. This is like basically sand. I feel, kind of feel like I'm walking on a beach. Something unique about this park is when you look around, there's just so many different textures, all the different rock formations around you and the plants. So, all trails said this was an easy hike, but low key, well high key, just looks like it's uphill from here. Let's do it. Yeah, when they meant the trail is not maintained, they, there's literally no trail. It's just rocks, which is fun, honestly. This feels really cool. Oh man. Yeah, that doesn't look like a normal trail. You got this. Well, we made it. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, it's a little windy. But wow. We're on top of the world. It's a beautiful view up here. We're gonna enjoy it. We are officially done with the Mastodon Peak loop, and that was, I'd say, moderate. Definitely not easy. On the way back, we kind of got off the beaten path, you could say. We thought we were going on the loop, and then we found ourselves in the middle of no trail. Yeah, and then somebody was like, hey, you're way off the trail, and we were like, oh. Oh, crap, we cool. look like idiots. <laughs> yeah. But, but we made it back. We it did. It was a good hike. So I found a campsite on Campendium, and it's a it's like a nomad van life campsite. That's what the title said. So you're like, all right, we're nomads, right? Yeah. Let's just show up, and you know, we always do this first come first serve kind of thing. So we didn't think it'd be a big deal. 
and uh, we showed up and I reread on Campendium like how we pay and like what we're supposed to do. And it's technically not a first come first serve campsite. You're supposed to book in advance and you're supposed to text the guy before you show up. And this is like his private property. So we were getting a bit nervous and I texted him and he told us to sit in the exact spot that we're in right now. So luck of the draw number 2000 on this trip. Good morning from inside our tent. I'm up here cleaning up the tent before we set it down like I do every morning and Andrew's down there making some coffee. It has just turned 8.31, which might be the latest start that we've ever gotten in a day since doing this trip. But unfortunately, being in the desert area last night, we had such strong winds. It sounded like this. and it kept us up almost all night. I think we only got a few hours of sleep, like I'm saying like two or three if we're lucky. It's definitely gonna be a tough morning, but we're gonna try to enjoy Joshua Tree as much as we can with this little sleep, drink some coffee, and try to get some work done. I'm really wondering how this audio is gonna sound. I don't think it's gonna sound very good. The wind is ridiculous, not only last night, but right now, it is so windy and it's about 50 degrees so it's a, it's a little chilly and I'm wearing shorts. I got the wind muff. But we got the wind muff so hopefully this makes a difference. I don't know if it will but we're going to be hiking Ryan Mountain Trail which is about a, one and a half miles and I think it goes straight up. Might as well let's, just, let's get started. If you watched our Guadalupe National Park vlog, this reminds me of that. Very similar, I guess, in the scenes, but mostly the massive wind gust in walking uphill right now. Yeah, massive. It'll just knock you off your feet. It's not a time lapse, that's how fast the clouds are moving. <laughs> This is like a wind tunnel, holy crap. If anyone wants to Venmo us for a new tripod, please do. This thing is so annoying, it breaks off. I think it has to do with the cold weather and some frustration that we had early in the trip. <laughs> Well, we made it. We made it. And you get a great view of the entire park from every single angle. Except I didn't know we were 5,400 feet. I thought it was only like 3,000 feet. It's kind of bittersweet though. This is our last day in California. We've had so many fun adventures here. It's just kind of bittersweet. All right, we are officially headed back down. Let's go. basic hiking footwork. I'm gonna be releasing a $20 course <laughs> about how to hike properly. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Maybe it's not worth $20. Champion. We, we made it through the wind. I think the two hours of sleep is getting to us. <laughs> Andrew asked if I was ready for the next hike and I said, do I look ready? Do yes. I look ready? Yes. Put on my hat for this round. Yeah, we gotta start moving or else I'm literally gonna fall asleep. All right, energy in three, two, one. All right, we're ready to go, oh gosh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we're ready to go. Go home, that is. The wind's too crazy. <laughs> so windy out here. But this is the Wall Street Mill Trail. Apparently this is a very historical trail, yet we don't know why and we see a metal car. But you get a beautiful view of the Joshua trees. As far as I know, the Joshua tree is not a tree, nor a cactus. Mm -hmm. It is part of the lily family. So take what you will with that one. <laughs> and we'll figure out what other interesting facts there are about Joshua trees. They look cool. They're just gonna put this out here with no info? Apparently. Mm. Well, we've been walking aimlessly for, I'd say probably about half a mile. Saw one sign, maybe took a wrong turn, 
and uh, we honestly have no clue where we are. So we're gonna turn around. <laughs> we are back at the campsite. It's not as windy, but it is a little bit colder, but we need to shower. We are gross, so let's go do that. It's gonna be an outdoor shower in 64 degrees, and I'm already chilly, so I just hope to God the water's not freezing. <laughs> Honestly, it's been one of the better showers that I've done. Other than it's an outdoor shower and you're kind of nervous at all times, but you have good views and the water pressure and heat were spot on. All right, good luck, enjoy it. I'm cold, but the shower itself was actually really nice. If it wasn't super windy, it would be perfectly fine. Trying to walk as slow as I can to not get dirt in my clean but wet Crocs. <laughs> No, oh, I think I just did. And I think that's what he's doing. That's why he's walking so funny. My hair is gonna dry sticking up because of this wind. 